Sends him out on strike. And both these batsmen are no strangers to coming in uh, to bat in a situation like this. He just and what does bat at number three, even in a test match. But uh, was he for quite some time in his career, even in Zimam used to bat at three till he was uh, shifted up and down the batting order. In the beginning, yes, when he uh, joined Pakistan team in 1992. Uh, in the World Cup, he started off at batting number three and it, it did do well in the beginning of the World Cup games. And then he got back to number, shifted back to number six and the way he started getting his runs. And I think he's a very good uh, number three, number four batsman. One reason why it could be handy for Pakistan that he's out there as early as this is simply because he's got all the shots in the book, doesn't hesitate playing them, and does pack a punch when he hits it. Definitely, he is an attacking player and I believe he has to change his game at times. He, ha he, he has done it in the past and he can do it this time as well. The boys just have to, the boys just have to play it according to the ball and just leave, it, leave the new ball outside of stump and wait. Uh, because after this, there's only Salim Malik and uh, uh, Moeen Khan, the regular batsman we have. Pakistan just behind the run rate, but it really doesn't matter at this stage. The importance uh, for them now is to try and uh, string a partnership. At this early stage of the innings, that's uh, not much of a difference. The important, is that they, the important thing is that they must have wickets in hand uh, towards the end of the innings. Same line as Akhi bowled in the beginning of the innings. And coming back to Jaz, I think he has uh, been a tremendous player for Pakistan for the last two years, like you said earlier uh, on. Just because of not his ability, uh, because of his hard work, and he really works hard, he's a team man. And he loves to perform for Pakistan and play for Pakistan. Last year, I mean, this year in West Indies, he was, he was bowling in swing to a right hand, and today he's uh, bowling away. Look at his bowling away to a right hander. Has he improved or has he just learned out swing? I think he has learned the out swing. He's, he's a kind of bowler who works very hard on his action. He's a thinking bowler. He had a hard job to do in the West Indies because uh, Srinath was injured. The wickets were, uh, at least in four test matches, pretty slow. Not much movement in them. and. Uh, I think he stood the test pretty well and uh, he's grown in confidence and it's showing now even in this spell of his. He's definitely experienced bowler. He's uh, 20, uh, 29 years old and he can bowl a very good slow ball. I've seen him bowling a very good slow ball at the end of the innings. That's right, he's come up the hard way. He's taken lots of wickets in domestic cricket and to wait quite some time to get an opportunity to play in big time. He's done well so far. It's 22 for 2. 